For some of you, we're right here at the cusp of it. We want another week. Yeah. We're going to do it one play at a time. We're going to bring the freaking hammer to them. Every single play. Yeah. Down up and down up and down. Yeah. San Clemente head coach John Hamro, just a little excited, don't you think? His Tritons have made it all the way to the Pac-5 championship game where they will await some tough knocks from Santa Margarita. After a San Clemente field goal, the Eagles look to punt, but Julian Perry runs into kicker John McGrory. Penalties usually lead to points, and Ryan Wolpin is a perfect example. A 33-yard touchdown run puts Santa Margarita ahead 7-3. And you aren't going to believe this catch by Christian Tobert. Triton's quarterback Travis Wilson heaves it up, and somehow Tobertron corrals it but the play only leads to another SC field goal. Santa Margarita's Johnny Stanton takes over, but Christian Bailey is there to break up the pass. Later, Mike ellis Peru charges in for a three-yard score. San Clemente takes a 13-7 lead. Stanton looks to answer as he has enough time to throw it up to River Craycraft, who makes an outstanding leaping catch. And the Craycraft-Stanton combo isn't done yet. Stanton finds him for an eight-yard score. The Eagles take back the lead at 14-13 going into the half and somebody give these guys some shirts. Back to the game. Johnny Stanton has the rock and he activates beast mode. He nearly drags the entire city of San Clemente with him and drives them forward. Later in the drive, Stanton fakes to Wolpin and jumps into the end zone. 21-13, Eagles. Meanwhile, the epic clash between San Clemente's Kyle Murphy and Santa Margarita's Max Turk leaves Travis Wilson in a world of hurt. The Eagles take over and embark on an endless drive that nearly ate up 10 minutes of game time. But it looks like the Tritons finally get a break as Tober picks off Stanton, but it's brought back on a controversial P.I. call. Later, the Eagles settle for a field goal attempt, but San Clemente is called for encroachment. Harry Welch huddles his massive line, and they're going for for it instead. The Eagles end up converting and later it's Stanton with a pitch to Wolpin for a three yard touchdown run. The Eagles drop the dagger and lead 27-13 with over three minutes left in the game. San Clemente marches into Santa Margarita territory but there's River Craycraft to make the pick of his life. The Eagles go on to win the Pac-5 championship over the Tritons, 27-13. Oh, it means so much to us. This is a great feeling. It's a crazy stadium for us to play at. I mean, it's just, it's very emotional. It's really great. Every practice of everything we put into that field, blood, sweat, and tears, we just know how hard we worked for this, and we feel like we deserve it. I think the long drives really helped us to roll down the clock, and um, in the end, we came out with the championship. I love it. We lost the game, but as far as I'm concerned, uh, it was a, a tremendous year.